Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel where today I'm going to be sharing with you my very late August favourites. The reason I have been running late is because I had my birthday weekend and then I went to Ibiza with my work due, hence why I've got a croaky voice. It's been a little bit crazy the last couple of weeks, so hopefully now I can get back on track. You might notice that the camera quality is slightly different. I'm still learning to use this camera. My husband bought for my birthday the Canon 750D. I'm in love with it, not just for trying to record at the moment, but for pictures and photography and stuff. I've always been into that. If you don't follow me on Instagram, then you should do. I'll leave it around here. I'm gonna crack on with my favorites. It's very hot in here, so my makeup might start slipping off my face. If you're wondering how I've done this eye look, this will be a video that is coming up soon. So let's go straight into favorites. This cute little owl bag. How adorable is that? This is from Poundland. Now we've got a Poundland here. I think they call it Deals, but it is by Poundland. I picked this up so like one euro 50, so you can probably get this anywhere in the UK. I carried all of my makeup in here and it fits my brushes, my makeup, all my hair clips and everything into one bag. Normally I'm that person who has like three different bags for stuff. So I'm in love with this cute bag. The next item I'm gonna show you guys is this Allure Dye Brow Kit. I always go and get my eyebrows done and then I found that I wasn't able to continue keeping them dark every month because of money. So I thought I'll give this a try. This worked so well. I kept it on for about 15 to 20 minutes. You get up to 12 applications. It is super easy to use. You can pick this up in Boots or Superdrug or anywhere online. I got mine from Amazon as I don't have Boots or Superdrug here in Spain. So if you're looking to do a DIY at home or you would like to even see me do mine and shaping my eyebrows, then let me know. Gonna keep going on with makeup beauty side of things. I am loving this sleek matte me lipstick. It is such a beautiful color. I'm wearing it today. It's easy to apply. I find even though it's matte, the best thing to do is apply some, a little bit of lip gloss first of all, or to actually put a bit of Vaseline on. And then this goes on a lot smoother and you can do a couple of coats and you're not kind of getting the streakiness anywhere. I had another one of these. I think I have it in like the birthday suit color, but I can't find it anywhere, but I'm loving these. On to concealer. One of my August favorites is the perfect match concealer. I found out about this through um, Dramatic Max channel. She has a very similar skin type to me. I've probably mentioned her before in my videos to you guys. And I just find that the consistency of this doesn't go cakey at all. I think I wanted to get it in a slightly lighter color, but they didn't have it. Mine's in four beige and I am wearing it now and I don't like my under my eyes to be too white. So really liking this concealer at the moment. I've been using for months now though, the collection Lasting Perfection, and I just find that the consistency is too thick and it immediately goes cakey under my eyes. So this L'Oreal one, I'm loving at the moment. So as I mentioned before at the beginning of my video, I've just come back from Ibiza. So you can imagine it's hot, you're partying, you're dancing, you want your makeup to stay on all day, all night, whenever you're wearing it, even with that sun beaming down on you. Ben Nye Final Seal. This stuck my makeup on for the entire evening to the point where I've actually broken out because my makeup stayed on my face so well. So this, I don't know where you can buy it in the shops. I got mine off of eBay. It is a small bottle, but I've had this for about two, three months now. I flipped between this and another one, but I found if you really want it to stick on your face and you don't want it to move anywhere, give this a go. It smells like peppermint as well. So that's an added bonus. My last favorite regarding makeup, it is the I Heart Makeup Salted Caramel. So Makeup Revolution Salted Caramel. This palette I have been reaching to every single day. It's got the most gorgeous colors in it. I'm using two of these, or maybe now I'm using three of these on my eyes today. The fallout is minimal. The colors are so pigmented. And it looks like a bar of chocolate, which is kind of cool. But in all honesty, this, is my go-to palette at the moment. That's the end of the makeup side of things. These two other items aren't beauty related at all. I wanted to share with you guys my favorite, probably my favorite favorite of August. It is my Pandora. I have finally completely finished it. Each and every one of these charms means something to me. I've got my wedding anniversary on here because that was just recently. I've got some my birthday charms and stuff. I might do an updated Pandora one because it wasn't complete when I did my last video. I'll link that one in the down below if you haven't seen it already. But this is my August favorite. It's so beautiful. And I think it's time to buy a new chain 
but my mother-in-law did buy me this box where you can slide all of your charms on and change them up and everything so I can always do that but I just wanted to share with you guys this and if you haven't got one or you're a guy and you're watching this these are great presents people can always buy you charms for your Christmas for your birthday for a special occasion so Pandora my favorite the next item I want to show you guys is completely different and it's been my favorite for quite a few months but I wanted to make it kind of aware to you guys is this Katie Piper book. Now this is called Start Your Day with Katie. It's 365 affirmations for a year of positive thinking. My friend Jade bought me this and I've been quite up and down and I have suffered with depression and I have suffered with anxiety and to be able to wake up every day and read a page which matches to the date does make you feel better. So let me give you an example. What's the date today? Today is the 11th. The wording in this one is, I am not afraid I was born to do this. If you find that you can be quite negative sometimes or you need a pick me up, this book will come in handy because I find when you wake up in the morning and you read that positive quote, no matter whether you're feeling positive or negative or neutral, whatever you're feeling, this book really does lighten up my mood. I keep it in my bathroom, so you can imagine if I'm having my morning pee or something, then I'll just quickly read whatever quote it is of the day. So if you haven't seen this book already, it's awesome. So guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed, that's the red button down below. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Are you ready? No. I'm going to make you look magnifique. So the first charm is from my mother-in-law, this one here. I got given it for my birthday.